Wow, I was not expecting this at all. I've already been through this cutscene, but I'm doing it again for some weird reason. Oh, I... There, okay. Hmm, I'm gonna put it back on pause. Alright, back to recording. Officially this time, okay, as a beginning of you disclaimer, April is not real! She is a cartoon character, and the voice is generated by AI, by me speaking to a microphone in a program, redoes my voice to sound like a Aztec feathered serpent or somebody like that. Okay, so I've been doing a lot of pausing and recordings and stuff. You saw just a second ago that that cutscene with Perseikis popped in again for whatever reason. And now I'm going to like the last couple of checks I can do down here. I skipped them earlier. And there's actually a third check that I can do. Yeah, some of these guys are... Oh, well, that... <laughs> Thank cough away from the mic. Oops. I don't ha I didn't get the... Pendulum. So I'm... So I'm kind of... Uh, I didn't get the pendulum earlier or whatever that item was, so I gotta be careful of the shroom towers. Oh. Yeah! The Midnight Cloak of Paul Revere. Uh, I know about the uh, shortcut right there. I've never been able to get it to work right for me. Okay. Oops. I can get to a check down here. Maybe not. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Okay. Yikes. Um. Whew. Ow. Ah, oh, boy. I can try and do the uh, light wall skip at the um, beginning here, but it's just not. Okay. Oh, back to the castle. I'm gonna put it on pause one more time to save. Save time. Oops. There it is. Alright, unpaused. So, I didn't go through here earlier because of just lack of magic power. Biggest problem comes about is here in another minute. Ugh. Check up there. Alright. Ah, good. Whoopee. Till I get to fly back this way. There is a check. Uh, the problem is, it's just getting to it with so little magic. This is a difficult one to go through. One. Uh, some 
One thing I can hope for now is if there's a, uh... Huh. Oh, boy. That's one thing I've never done is just taken the uh, gravity boots and just gulp this way. Gonna get no choice on that. the other side of them. Okay, go. I made it up to here. I gotta be careful about this. Yeah. You need to come down there first? Might start. Nope, not yet. <laughs> well, that was not smart. Uh, now she's doing her double double spin. The exact time I'm supposed to takes freaking forever. One of the longest times it's ever taken me to find those dang keys. Ah, uh, I, I I got I know I got like a check over. <laughs> On the other side, but I can't quite get to him just yet. Oof. Common mistake that I make as I wind up scooting the wrong way. There we go, finally warp shards. I know I'm gonna be going probably in that. Okay, now that I have the warp shards, where shall I warp? Ooh. I can go back, I can actually go to the, uh, pyramid. My time looking like nine minutes, so... Use items... Oh, I gotta go to the Dagon thing first. I guess since I actually haven't traveled through any doors yet.
Okay, usually I like to check the pyramid out. I have found important items in here. Yeah. Koopy. I'm not trying to be too concerned about saving time, or I would, uh, reset. Caves. <laughs> I can go through part of this. Hmm, can't get to the other one over there. Won't let me go there. So I got no choice but to go here. Oof. 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 Nothing. Nothing to the right. Except the, uh... Really bad thing. I just don't have the power right now to fight it. Oh boy. Yeah, I, I can't see that thing winding up. Do I have... I potion, I berry pick me up, mind refresh, nope. Need to probably go ahead and get this on. Uh, oh, I did buy the pendulum. Uh, boy. Oof. Use items. Hopefully this won't. Oh, man, that was so stupid. Forgot about those guys sitting right there. Okay, I can now go into the hangar, but I can't. Uh, but I have to get out of here first somehow. And I got another snailer. I kind of paused there for a little quick second when I thought he was going to fire and... Ugh. Oh boy, I got the, uh... Those thingies. I can... Yeah, it'd be better if I actually had some sand to work with. Had the... Could have used that a lot earlier. Okay, there is a save point right over here that can help me out. Okay, a couple more spots up here. Uh, 14 minutes on the clock. Okay. Oh, looks like a... Yep. We had a couple of checks over here to make, and then I gotta go make that loop. They loop all the way again. Go back through here again, and you all get to see it. Oh, 
I might do it a... Oh. That's supposed to be really down here till much, much later in the game. Here comes our tough part, and that is... We got much more, more of those dang mushroom tires with the creepy crawly mushrooms. And I got those uh, swinging vines. Potion. Alright, talking about the swinging vine is coming up, and that is a tough one to get to. Ah, hand cramp, hand cramp. Blue. Well. Okay, and get about that far away, and they will. Uh, dust won't get to me. Throw that stuff out there now, can it? I'm not gonna wait on him. Oh, that's a good thing to get right there. <laughs> After the tunnel. Okay, a couple things to... Well, I'm at the beginning of the game. wanting to get <laughs> gotta get a couple checks down here <laughs> the music you're hearing is what you hear at the beginning of the game and that's because I don't have the uh, time spinner wheel just yet hmm can't get to that one just yet Nothing I can do. I have to go back this way. Let's see. Once I get the time spitter wheel, the music will change. Uh, I need a I need to burn these vines a thousand years ago to get to that treasure chest. Oh, 
Oh, it opens up a check in the castle. I can actually do that pretty quick since I get to walk door. And then I kind of hold off on that for a while. That gave me a lot of points pretty quick. Uh, I'm just not getting any good stuff right off the bat. I, I had some like really good things to begin with, some good armor, but now... Because sometimes I uh, kind of mutter under my breath about shit that's going on in my life, and I gotta be very careful about that. I don't want to have to uh, put this through the through the uh, video editor, or have to just cancel gameplay and start over from the beginning. I already talked about the bad day I had today, I'm trying to keep it uh, as undercover as possible. Talk about it, but not talk about it. That's the nice thing about the wind blade, it actually goes pretty dang fast. The nice thing about having some having a multiple jump in this action is I can go through it maybe a little bit quicker. And also get hit a lot quicker too. Okay. While I'm here. Oops, bumped my scratching an itch. I can go here. Sometimes I've had that open up with... Well... Ugh. Usually in the, uh, whenever I play the main game, I'll, I'll hook up Plasma Orb pretty early. I forgot about this. I can... should be able to do this now. Not down there, right there. a pretty good one to start with. You get to play like punch out the entire rest of the game. Oh, I got an ether. Um, key. the C card, I don't have... 
the D or anything else. Okay. All right. I got my B card. I got my B card. Uh, I get Merchant Crow activated. Okay, don't really need... Don't plan on activating it anytime I need to. Only time I really need to is when I'm actually at the very end of the game. Oh, finally. Hmm. Oh, by the way, that reminds me. Don't need that on. I'll put chaos horn on for the time being. I can go in there. Um, but that will just have, like, use items or maybe some armor. It might even have the tablet. That's a distinct possibility. Oh, that's right, uh... Without the tablet, I can't even really do those checks yet. Yeah, today started out started out good. I got up early. I was actually gonna do this recording like at like six o'clock in the morning. And then I got a call from one of my bosses telling me that I was supposed to be uh up somewhere with a client. And I thought I had the day off. That's why you make these checks. And of course, if I had, you know, done my job as an employee, been professional, that I pretend that I am on occasion, I would have been able to meet the client on time. Oh, sure, now I get the antidote. I thought I was actually having the day off because I'd been kind of working pretty hard over the weekend. That's what I thought. That some of the messages that he sent me, that's what made me think that. So but the higher ups are looking into it and and it looks like things are going to kind of settle down a little bit here. That could be useful later. Bet you if I go try and do that tower jump without the uh, double jump. That's the thing, one of the things I'm looking for right now. A beginning item to scythering. It gives you knives on your orbs and... Usually it's something that whatever I play a normal game, I keep up until about towards the very end. Oh. Okay. Well, I can't go down, I can't go up, I can't do anything. I can't get into the... Uh, so I'll go do a warp. Let me figure out what else I can do right now. Underground's pretty clear. I can't... I can't go into that area. Sealed off. I have to go back to the past. Um, I need the elevator card key. That may be in that one area. I don't really want to go through the uh, time gyre right now. So what I'll do here is... There, I'm supposed to be on this one. Can't get down river yet because I'm not... Okay, so I'll just keep Wind Orb up. Brunel Flames. Hmm. 
Go this way. Can't go into water yet. Oop. Oh my god, I am stuck. Uh-oh. This is not good. Is what, um... Did my controller die on me? I cannot. Uh-oh. No, this is good. Let's see. Uh-oh. Controller is not working. It has disconnected. So, let's restart. Figure out how I can restart this controller. <laughs> uh... Restart... PS5 controller. That's not... Okay, the, what I'm looking up here is actually how to get it back to factory setting. What I need is... Turn... Turn PS5 controller off. Accessories? Oh. Okay. I guess to turn the... One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, darn. PS5 controller is not working at all right in the middle of this run. God, I hope I don't have to. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna look at settings. Bluetooth and devices. Okay. Add connect. It's not doing it, so go back to Firefox and figure out how it's supposed to connect. Ugh, come on. Connect PS Live controller to. Here's one from PC Gamer. A little article. It's where the console is 50 straight, so why not take it on a PC? As yeah, so only stated, raise the gamers. Hey, thank, but, but thank you. Thank you to Steam for turning. Thanks to Steam turning a DualSense controller into an everyday gamepad. No, it's not. This is, how long ago was this article? 2024? Wow, this... They must have done some fixes, because the last time I tried using it on a regular Steam, it didn't quite work out too well. I think the Steam here is step by step. Okay, wired, Bluetooth. Okay. So, oh, it turned off. So, it turned off on its own. Okay. Okay, now it's doing all kinds of stuff. Man, man, boy. <laughs> okay, do that. I may have to restart the computer. Oh, dang. I just noticed I'm at 35, so, um, I'm gonna stop here and see what 